attach the power cord and the network cable into the rear of the machine. Press the button located on the lower right hand cover to start up the printer. Allow the machine up to 10 minutes to warm up, so please be patient. On the operation panel screen, the machine will ask for the language you're going to use. English is already selected. Press Next. You'll now be asked to set up time zone and date and time. Press Go to Settings. First, we'll set the time zone. In our example, we will use Central Time, United States. Highlighted. Now set Summertime. In our example, we will select it to On. The next screen, Date and Time, will appear. Change these settings if needed. Once done, press Next. You will now see Set the IP address to enable the device to run on your network. Go to Settings. You will see DHCP set to On. Press Next. You'll see Email Transmission. Press Skip. Set Home Screen. Press Skip. Set Other Settings. Press Go to Settings. The Routine Machine Consumable Replacement Status Message will appear during normal operation. It is defaulted to On. Press Next. You will see Prevent Miss Sending. Select Skip. To complete setup, press Finish. You should now see Completed and Are you sure you want to print a status page? Since this is the first time the machine has been turned on, you will need to add paper to the cassette. For now, just add letter paper. Select Print. The machine will say Accepted and will return to the home screen and will print out a two-page status report. For more details on adding paper, please refer to the Adding Paper video. For details on the altitude adjustment, please refer to the altitude adjustment video.